Let's start the day off with the breakfast of champions. Banana split. All right, so just gonna be putting more panels in. Uh, I'm not gonna record it, not even gonna time lapse it. Uh, when I'm done with it, I'll show you guys what I did. I'll explain to you guys everything that I did. And um, we'll just go from there. Uh, right now, um, I took this panel back off, this rear panel right here, uh, because um, I, like I say, I salvaged some of these clips. So I, I'm putting them on now, and so that, so that they'll clip better. You can actually see the crack here now. And um, I have an AC delete duct at home or, or here or somewhere, maybe at home at my parents' place. But um, I'm still debating if I want to take it out. It's possible. I did that with the other one, but everything's here. So we'll see how it goes. I'll be right back. Look at that space. I love it. I love these dollies. Best investment ever. Naval jelly. Rust dissolver. What's in here? Let's go see. I don't know what happened, but I think that they left a bunch of stuff outside and it got rusty. And these are bolts. Let's see if I can rinse them off. They were basically crusty, rusty. This stuff does not smell good. There it is. Already looks better. Rinse them off. better that you can actually see the threads now I'll take a uh, wire brush or something and brush them down I think that's good these are for rear middle seat belt section the, the little middle pieces I'll update you guys when I finish more because I've been putting so much stuff in hey okay, so this is the update. This panel is in again. Um, it has two retainer clips up here, but I had to take the one from the far back and put it over here in the front so that that one has one. Both of those retainer clips were go missing. So now that side is complete. The seat belt is in. I'm missing this trim here. If you have it in black, let me know on both sides. And um, that side is done. Uh, seat belts are in, in the back. This one is the one that was uh, giving me an issue. Um, I had to, it was kind of tweaked, and so I had to uh, put it in halfway, use a hammer to smash it straight, the direction straight, and then um, put it in all uh, the rest of the way. So now that's good. These belts are good. Um, I don't have this trim on the other side. If you have it, hook me up, let me know. Uh, put this piece in right here, this little liner piece, all the way around it. Put that in. Uh, the whole rear section is complete now. The seats can go in now. Um, just gonna drop the bottom one in and then put the top one on, and it should be complete. And then I gotta go pick up my kid from school. If you have a black deck, Kooky with the uh, third brake light, hook, hit, hit me up. I have both of these trims, but I don't know if I want to put them in yet until I get the deck. It'd be a pain. I have to take these panels off again, but these are easy to take off. Um, yeah, this is taking me a good part of the morning. Nothing goes as planned as per usual. Big old hole here, I have to patch that. Oh, shit. Oops, and then, um, Gotta get this welded. This also has a hole down here. You see that? But um, 
I am not gonna complain because these are so hard to find. <clears throat> And then I put that trim, the handle in, put the handle in, put all of this trim in, put the back trim in. Um, I realized I don't have the these pieces here. I do have the sun, the visors. I'm gonna put those in. The big parts are done. Just gotta finish all the trim. I think that's it. See this third brake light? I don't even know. Some of the things, man, he included are from different cars. Kick panel, I'm sure, is from um, the A6. I put the other side kick panel in over there where the blue tape is. I'm gonna drop in the glove box. I should just do that, get that out of the way. And just keep on trucking. Oh. All my little bolts, nuts. I do need one that goes here, which I can't seem to find that matches. I want like a matching set. These two will fit, but I don't want to just throw anything in there. So, I'll keep you guys. So, <clears throat> everything's installed. Nice and clean, just vacuumed. I'm gonna put everything in right now and I'll show you guys when the whole rear is done. Let me get a wider view of this. Before. After. Looks good. That side is complete. Mine is the seat belt because I that one on the ground that's next to the boxes. Uh, it was provided, but it's the wrong one. No idea what happened there. Seats are clean except for one little cigarette hole, but every every bracket, every piece is in right now. Installed correctly. Should work. There it goes. Look at that. Look at that. Beauty. Interiors back in. If you guys have this black piece, let me know. If you guys have a black driver's side seat belt, let me know. Watch it. Listen to it click. Mm, so good. Seat belt is in. This piece is in. This whole area is in, minus this. Um, probably gonna throw that in. This is the back trim piece that I'm gonna install right now in the trunk. It holds the carpet down. And that's my stockpile of bolts. Without these, I wouldn't have been able to put anything back together. It's a good thing to be a hoarder sometimes. All right, gotta keep going. All right, so installed third brake light with the cover, used my, um, those clips that I bought. Those have been coming in handy. Installed these two rear uh, C-pillar covers. I wasn't going to, but <laughs> I don't want to be storing them somewhere, so I just threw them in. Look good. And it's so comfortable now. Now that I have these, see how warped this is? But it's all right. Threw that little trim piece in to hold it tight. Most of these are gonna be held in by pressure from other panels. It looks good. Went from nothing, absolutely nothing shell, as you guys all saw, mm -hmm. to pretty decent. And I have matching seats, like I said. Hey, what's up? What am I doing? I'm sitting in my 
87 Corolla. Let me see if I can show you guys. That's it right here. Still really dirty, but everything that I got from the guy is in. Just need carpet. Carpet, some trim pieces, and and I think I'm good. I have seats at home. I said that three times now. I'm gonna replace this with a period correct one. That might even work. I don't know. I know that's from like a '89 Corolla. <laughs> Chilling. Chilling. And then we got the little center console in. This little shift boot. No, this little, yeah. Shifter, shifter boot, uh, gasket. I even have the shift knob. Shift knob's on the roof. Came with a spin turn knob. A little JVC stereo and like a weird plate. I'm gonna put the put the visors in and then call it a day. It's been a long day of installing. It's not just installing; it's like fixing and then installing and then fixing and cleaning and then installing. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'm having a lot of fun getting a lot of things done quickly. Get this car ready to go as soon as as soon as um. We're able to find some time to do the swap. I, sh I should be able to pull the inf all the stuff out of my uh, coupe and then put it in my silver one and put it in this one. Unless you have a crash GTS, you want to sell me for under two thousand? I'll take it from you. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit that like and hit that like button. Subscribe. Tell your friends. And I hope I can continue to bring cool content. I appreciate everybody who's been commenting. Um, if you know anybody with a Supra who needs some parts, hit them up. Tell them to hit me up. Um, I'm looking to get rid of those. Um, I still have a little bit of stickers left. We'll be uh, trying to design different stickers uh, here pretty soon. And the printer, I haven't talked to the guy who makes the shirts yet. Uh, I'm thinking um, maybe soon uh, we'll see but uh, yeah thanks for watching guys I appreciate you guys oh and I'm almost to 200 subscribers I'm pretty excited um, fingers crossed it's gonna happen soon I think I'm like four away and then after that just keep on trucking peace